Good day, two Grenade Collectibles here for a Payaso Diorama review. It is the IKEA Detop Diorama. Here we can see that the diorama can be assembled easily as there are magnets attached to each end which you can just simply snap on. So here is the diorama built. The good thing about this is Roger of Payaso Diorama makes sure that there is detail in each piece. Uh, it is very artistic. It is uh, custom made. I coordinate with him to make this design. You can see here the window can be detached and it can be torn down to several pieces as well as the magnets hold them together. It gives you flexibility on how you can use this particular window as you can see here. Spider-Man can simply attach to the balcony easily. The maximum load of this balcony is two regular sized Marvel Legend figures. Anything above that will break it. <laughs> so here we have the garage door which can be easily removed. So you just simply slide it down slowly just to make sure you won't break it. It's made out of cardboard and it's a bit soft. Then we put back the garage door and the other pieces. This door can fit up to 10 inch tall figures, but that's the maximum. As you can see here, we can fit Marvel Select figures and McFarlane toys as well. It comes with an extension floor, which is magnetized as well. You can attach it there on the side and then pull out one of the walls and put it on the extended floor as you can see here it makes the space bigger so you can mo create more dramatic uh, scenes you can switch the sides of the walls so here i will switch the red wall to the other side here we have the battle damage sides of the wall which is the reverse side you can see here some blood effects from slide effects they look good as long as, as with the optic blast as well so you can just simply mix and match as you can see here the battle damage wall I thought of is good for the X-Men scene like battling a dystopian future here we can see some slide effects of, again the blood effects that you can see on the Batman Devastator you can fit 7 inch scale figures here but you can see the balcony is yeah they tower above the balcony now the challenge is to be able to display it inside an ikea detolf as you can see here you can find a way to fit them there's a little gap that will allow you to to maneuver and put the pieces in it will make the inside of the, the I mean the IKEA little very dark, but you can make this kind of scene, which is awesome. I would suggest if you like it to be seen easily, is put some lightning on it. Here is natural light passing through the sides of the uh, the IKEA little. Thank you for reaching this far. <laughs> so here we have some metrics, the size of the pieces of the diorama. You can pause to see and look closely on the measurements as you wish. <laughs> the extension floor is a bit smaller compared to the main floor. Here are some diorama size comparison with Marvel Select dioramas that came with the figures from X-Men. You can see here the danger room as well. In terms of the other Marvel Legends figure, you can see here for the size, how it fits. In terms of packaging, you can see that Roger made sure to use a big box so that he can securely bubble wrap each piece. He even made a box for the balcony so it won't be crushed. He also used air pillows just to make sure that there's adequate spacing between the box and the diorama. Here's one of his work for my friend JP at Artemis underscore custom on Instagram. JP also makes um, custom figures, as you can see here. This diorama made by Roger exceeded my expectation. There was no diorama in the market that can actually fit perfectly in an IKEA detolf. 
Not only is it a space saver, it is very versatile. It can recreate scenes from Spider-Man, which is the alley scene. And when you reverse the walls, it can create a scene for X-Men, which is the battle damage walls. Roger of Payaso Diorama is really customer focused. He would spend time with you in order to make your diorama dream come true, as he did for mine. So feel free to contact him in Facebook. Special thanks to Slide Effects for the Vlad and Optic Blast effects here. Thank you for watching. Please like, subscribe, comment, and ring the notification bell.